obeyed the government because that's what America is founded on. If you research the history of America, it is obeying the government. The, okay. The masses are awake, okay? The masses are awake. And this is going to be representation of the masses. And then this is actually representation of the government. And then this is representation of the... military, and police force, okay? So, in countries that gave up their rights, okay, basically you have guns versus no guns, okay? But in America... We don't have that problem. Now, I'm not saying to rise up in violence or anything, nor am I saying anything against YouTube community guidelines. My, remember, remember, my belief system is 100% and should be interpreted as 1,000% adherence to the YouTube guidelines. Any misinterpretation on your end is your responsibility. Okay. I have dedicated my life to serve Susan Wojcicki. Okay? So, now, here we have guns versus guns. So, what I am predicting is there's going to be some violence. Okay, and the masses are going to win because the bottom line is this, all right? All of this is due to the monetary system crumbling before our eyes. The fiat monetary system is absolutely crumbling right now. And from what I'm seeing and what I'm taking away from this situation right now is it just doesn't, none of it makes sense, okay? None of it makes sense at all. Logically makes no sense. Remember, I just had mentioned what some doctors had come to a conclusion, a coalition of doctors, and I put it on YouTube, and that was my first time ever getting a community guideline strike. I didn't even say anything. I just played a video, okay? And they are putting out massive amounts of propaganda for people to take the vaccine, which you all should take. Forget the news that you've heard, people dying, and the side effects. It's all fake. Take the vaccine. Obey the government. Because that's what America is founded on. If you research the history of America, it is obeying the government. Do your research. Research the history of America. So, I think also the masses are awake in many things. How do I know? One thing, and one thing happened. Something big happened. Okay, now, like them, hate them, whatever. The point is this. You have to set your feelings aside whether you like them or you dislike them. The point is this. The average person is so awake to the point that they decided we would rather have a billionaire businessman be president 
than an established politician. Okay? They're like, we'll just give this fucking businessman a chance because that is how fed up we are. In addition to that, now the 2020 election was completely legitimate. Okay? I'm not saying that the election was rigged. Rigged. I am not saying the election was rigged. I am not saying that. I am not saying that there is a lot of evidence that would make you shake your head and say maybe something is different here. Okay? And I'm definitely not saying that the United States has interfered in other people's elections as well. I think that this these these people here are desperate. I think that there is super, super desperation. Israel, yeah, very good. Daddy Doku said, uh, D- Daku Daddy says, Israel's having a huge surge right now after being the most vaccinated population. And now even in Israel, they are revolting against their green pass. So the cat is out the bag. There's nothing coming back. And you have to realize this. When it comes to this right here, okay, they are the ones using this against these people. But when they decide to fight back using this, against this and this